Hey everybody, it's Holden with Final Expense Mastery and Equita Final Expense Services. I just wanted to get into the video real quick. This is about sitting on the edge of your seat. When you're in the client's home, your body language tells it all. So I see this with a lot of new agents, but sometimes even agents that are well versed in this business, you know, they're they're veterans of, and they're just they got the commission breath. So instead of being seated like this and kind of relaxed back and everything, they're on the edge of their seat and they're like, you know, elbows forward, right? And they're, you know, really like aggressive. Now there's certain points in the sales process when you need to be along those lines where you're on the edge of your seat because you're engaging and you're taking control of the conversation, right? That's important, but normally it's just kind of sitting nice and relaxed back and just having just a normal conversation with your client so that type of mannerism can really either scare someone off and be extremely unattractive to them or can have you know kind of the the adverse effect when you're using it properly to the point where it's actually going to enable you to get the sale done so when you're taking control of the situation you're asking those hard questions that's pretty important whereas if you're just on the edge of your seat the whole time you're really going to scare them off and you're just saying hey you know I'm here to sell you something and you're super aggressive without even knowing it. So don't sit on the edge of your seat unless you really need to during that sales process. We'll use that to make some more money, guys.